Hello folks and welcome here once again to Divine Fine Motors and thank you so, so very much for being here. God bless you and your family and I mean that with all of my heart. I hope and pray that you're well, healthy and happy wherever you may be at this moment. And folks, look here what I found you. This is a Florida owned, only had two owners might have been the same owner too it was i saw it was sold when it had about 36 or 38,000 miles on it so it could have very well been a lease and they bought it out after their lease because it is absolutely in such excellent pristine immaculate divine condition that it looks like it's always had the same owner it's got the beautiful nice black soft sun down her top you all know this releases on the inside two handles mama can take her hand with one hand and flip that thing right back like a sunroof but look at this this is the willis uh, special edition the willis edition and man is it awesome first one we've had here at divine fine motors they came out with this jeep in 2014 it's got the big dana 44 rear end the locking differential the 3.73 axle i mean this they they think these are just awesome awesome jeeps and the color I mean, this to me is the perfect color right now. I tell you, everybody's going after this color. I think they might call this the Anvil or uh, I'm not sure what Jeep's uh, name is for it. And that's a factory four-wheel drive emblem that you get on it. You get also this nice black gloss factory uh, Jeep wheel, which looks fantastic. And by the way, this one has the nice Goodyear Wranglers on it uh, the dura tracks all the way around it there are two 55 75 r17s uh, this is probably the one that came on it brand spanking new if it's not then they replaced it with some nice new ones uh, but anyway this jeep is absolutely awesome uh, it's got the big 3.6. I think when I was studying on this Jeep, they said it's like 285 horses, uh, which is awesome. Of course, it's a six-cylinder. It's the five-speed automatic transmission. The factory original paint, folks, this thing doesn't hardly have a mark on it anywhere. It's just absolutely gorgeous. You also get the nice glossed out, blacked out uh, grill and the little accessory thing there on your front bumper with these uh, Willis edition. But what a awesome, awesome Jeep. And you wait till you see the interior, it's just like it. You've got the rock crusher that comes from the factory, uh, the fender flares, which looks great. I love the color. With the black wheels, the black top, and this, I call it like a cement gray or whatever they want to call it there. And like I said, folks, she's a Florida owned. No rust or corrosion anywhere. It's just absolutely gorgeous. The wheels, the paint, it is just divine. It's just what we look for here. When I go out, I literally look over hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of vehicles just to find that perfect vehicle. There's nothing more much than I like better than to selling great, great vehicles to great, great people. But like I said, this guy looks like he might have drove this thing to church. You can see how nice and meaty those big Goodyears are. This thing's got the, uh, I think they put a uh, beefier suspension and shock and springs and stuff under these as well. Like I said, there's all of that is original no rust no corrosion even has the nice toe hitch there that thing don't have a speck of rust or corrosion on it either uh all the brakes it is just in excellent excellent condition doesn't need a thing doesn't even have a tire pressure light on and it is clean 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 I mean, the whole thing is just excellent. Of course, you all know who has been buying from us for the last, gosh, you know it's been 14 years. Look at that frame. And that's not pain either. I put a little armor all on there just to show you how nice and clean everything is. But every nut and bolt on this Jeep looks like that. It's just awesome. 
excellent, excellent vehicle. It looks like, like I said, this guy might have just drove this thing to church or something. I don't think it's ever, ever, ever been off-road or in the woods. I mean, there's not a scratch on it anywhere. But uh, it's awesome, man. It dries a bone under there, as you can see. Always has been. We've had it, oh, about a week or so. And uh, just now getting to it. My detailer quit on me, God love him. It's hard for me to keep a detailer because I'm so, so picky. I want everything done to perfection. And it's it's hard to get these fellows, whether they're young or old these days, to do any kind of work. So I might just go back to doing it myself. I did it for myself for 10 or 11 years. And my wife told me if I had to stop. She didn't want to walk out here and find me gave up the ghost here in the driveway <laughs> anyway this just blew my mind when i opened up this door this was a new car trade-in i got it from the dealer it was traded in at but it is just spotless all the carpet all the seats the console all the plastics everything is just what you would want in excellent excellent condition inside outside all the carpets fantastic the seats are amazing looks really like it's kind of been just a one person used vehicle but boy it is so so nice one of the great things let me tell you real quick one of the great things about having a jeep with no power windows is when you want to take that door off you just disconnect this little latch there's no power lines going into the window to go up or down so it makes it really really easy there's no windshield wiper on the back to have to con disconnect and stuff but you look at the look at the door jams and the latches and stuff it it really is super super nice it's the first year of this edition you keep this thing for about 30 or 40 years it's hard to tell what it'll be worth and believe you me it'll last you that long uh like i said i don't think honestly that the back seats were ever used in this thing of course you know they all they'll fold right down with you but it's spotless this whole Jeep is spotless. It's got a nice mat. You can turn that over for the rubber on the bottom, or you can use the carpet. I like the nice carpet in here. It is spotless. You wait till you see the inside of that tailgate, which is usually always scratched up, but whoever this fellow was, he loved on his Jeep. Or it might have been owned by a, a lady. Ladies seem to always take better care, and they have tremendous less wear and tear. Good job, ladies. And good job, some of you men out there who really, really take care of your stuff. But uh, it's a great one. Now, you all know we're located down here around Tampa, St. Pete, Clearwater area. That's in the middle of the state over here on the West Coast side, the Treasure Coast, they call it. But do you see how nice this is? This thing doesn't have a scratch on it. I love, love, love. You know, some people, they'll treat these Jeeps like they're a truck. But this is all, you, you just really tell some telltale signs. When you've been in this business for 36 years like I have, believe you me, you know what to look for when you're out there looking for somebody. And I don't buy nothing unless I wouldn't buy it for myself. Now, that's one good thing to see. See all your latches and everything, how nice and new everything looks. You want to make sure, too, a lot of times in Jeeps, and I'm not knocking them, but people take the tops off. They'll leave them in the rain and everything. But this guy, you can see, boy, look at that jack and stuff. Look down in there. It's just perfection. That is a divine find. That's what we look for. We look for perfection, but really nice. I think you're just going to absolutely love it. You want to take it and jack it up and put you some big wheels and tires. That's totally your business. But I tell you what, there's something to be said. They made this thing to look cool right from the factory, and it really does. Rides 1,000%. No pulling to the right or left. It goes, it stops, it does everything it's supposed to. It's nice and quiet. It's not too loud. And like I said, the interior is just like the exterior. The top and everything. It even has the tinted nice little windows, uh, you can see. But... Uh, somebody's gonna get a really really nice nice vehicle low miles too it's only got 118,000 miles that is nothing for these 3.6s 
I've seen many of them with 200 plus miles on them, and I'm sure this will give you that many, many times over. 118,335. Matter of fact, it's so nice. I'm taking my beautiful bride of 30 years out in it on Mother's Day. We're going to drive it down, and our son is going to take us out on his boat. But uh, uh, look at this. This is the driver's seat. This is a Jeep. I mean, this thing looks like it's been in a Lexus. Nice leather wrapped steering wheel that is absolutely immaculate as well. Again, all your plastics and everything on your door panels are in great shape. The carpet, folks, is just perfection. That's got some nice, those floor mats and Jeep floor mats came from Jeep. Those are Mopar. They came, they come in this Willis edition. And you also have a bunch of nice electronics. You've got the uh, Bluetooth. It'll pair right up to your phone. You can run your music through your phone, through your Spotify or whatever you have. It even has the original windshield in it, uh, which is pretty amazing. Uh, it's uh, ice cold air, like I say, four wheel drive, five speed automatic. It has all your controls in the steering wheel, which is super nice. Look, all that's still immaculate and not a light one on no tire light none of that nonsense i don't think you'll ever have any issues with this at all super nice stereo uh that's on i got a little talk radio on now but uh it's got a real nice stereo like i say your bluetooth and all that and you are good to go got some nice grab handles on here i'm going to show you the engine compartment and then i'm going to get off of here here's what we do i give everybody an equal opportunity to go ahead and buy it now before the reserve is met i have to pay for these i get the good ones and i give people an opportunity to go ahead and buy it at a fair profit for me and for you sometimes it goes beyond that and if it does, then I just have to sell it to the next highest bidder. So give me a call if you want to get it before it's gone. Mo listen to me. Most of our vehicles, it was bought brand spanking new right there at Ferkins. Uh, it just says it's got a high-tech computer and wants you to bring it in for service if it ever needs it. But anyway, it, uh, it's awesome. So just give us a call if you want to go ahead and get it now before the auction ends. And don't wait too long once you decide. I'm not an old car salesman. I'm not going to try to tell you to get it before it's gone. But you better call because this one, it probably will sell before the auction is over. We can also help you get it shipped. My lovely bride does that for only $50 for you. We signed up to a thing we pay a monthly fee for called Central Dispatch. And believe you me, that's well worth it. You can try to get it shipped on your own. And you will love dealing with her. Once you say you want it, she'll get a deposit from you. We'll get your sales packet out to you either that day or the first thing the next day. You'll love dealing with her. She's very thorough. She's very efficient. And she keeps you in the loop throughout the whole thing it'll be one of the best car buying experiences you ever had we've had over 3,000 customers and like i say we're celebrating 14 years this month or last month in april we're working on 15 how about that praise the lord thank you jesus and uh thank you all you've been a blessing to us and we believe and pray that we'll continue to be a blessing to you and your family and your friends as well god bless you be kind to one another lift each other up please 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 Read to those children. Tell them how great they are. Tell them how wonderful and uniquely and special they were when the good Lord made them. Give them a lot of confidence to go out and do great things in the world. Okay? We love you all. God bless you. And don't miss out on this one. I got to go. Bye-bye.